kind of continuing our recent journey toward doing some experimentation here today. And uh, we're here in my backyard just outside of Joplin, Missouri. I tend to use CCI shot cartridges a lot around here, you know, field rats and mice and, you know, the odd uh, dangerous snake who won't leave by the house or something. When I first got here, I thought, oh, the 22 long rifle would probably be good enough. And what I soon found out, though, was that there are <laughs> the, the different calibers, 22 Magnum, 22 long rifle, 45 Colt, there's a dramatic difference in the performance window on the different ones. And so it dawned on me that it might be a good opportunity for me to share sort of my own experiences here about just how effective these little miniature shotgun shells actually are in the real world. Uh, eyes and ears are on. We're at about, you know, two yards, three yards. Uh, what I found, especially the 22 long rifle version of these shot cartridges, is that beyond this distance, you really have lost virtually all effectiveness. We're shooting a Ruger Super Single Six, which is actually the very first handgun I ever owned. I've had this since I was 16 years old. So here we have CCI 22 long rifle shot cartridges. Uh, I'm a magazine editor, not an artist, uh, but that's a bad snake. Right, let's see what happens here. All right, we just took the shot uh, from kind of toe to toe distance. CCI 22 long rifle uh, shot cartridges. I believe this is number 12 shot, and there's just a teeny tiny bit of them. Uh, where it's actually not a bad group. You can see here at this distance, you, you really need to be close because it helps to concentrate the pattern. And with the really light shot we have here, you'll find this really very, has very limited effectiveness. In this situation on my very artistically correct snake, We've hit quite a few here. I think that this would have wounded him and maybe kind of stopped him, and you, but you would have had to shoot him two or three more times or like I like to do, just use a rock. You know? Now don't get all excited. I don't kill snakes for no reason. These are da dangerous snakes that refuse to leave near the house or something. Uh, out of curiosity though, let's uh, take this off and see what kind of penetration we have. And on the back of this, this is a little bullseye target that I use all the time. I, I actually can see where some of this shot cartridge failed to penetrate this paper. Uh, which will give you an indication of, of just how effective it is. Now this is pretty heavy, it's called clay-based paper, uh, but still, I actually see dents here where the, the shot did not penetrate it. Let's move on to the CCI 22 Magnum on a similar situation, let's see what happens. Okay, here we are, we're loaded up, this is a CCI 22 Magnum. Here's my extra deadly fat snake, and we're at the same sort of toe-to-toe -to -toe distance that I found these are most effective at. Let's see how this goes. You know, it's always fun to do this sort of thing because you always learn stuff. We definitely have a more effective load here. You can actually see the holes are slightly bigger and they appear to have all gone through the target. A little tighter group too, and I'm thinking that it's probably a function of the heavier shot. The lighter shot tends to get dispersed faster by the rifling. Uh, we have a couple of things of, of note here. Uh, you can actually see the plastic shot capsule imprint here and then you see the side of it here. I, I think this would actually be pretty effective on a snake or a rat or something like that. So let's pop it off the target. We'll take a peek at the rear. And, uh, and actually, I, I see complete penetration with all of these without any problem at all. And I see penetration in this double-walled cardboard, and it looks like they actually made it through the back, too. So this is significantly more effective than the 22 long rifle shot. And just between us, what I like to do with the 22 long rifle shot is come out here and chase wasps. It's kind of like a, playing P-51, you're chasing a Japanese Zero. We shoot them out of the air, except when you miss, and then they chase you. Uh, before we start here, I did a little investigating while we were doing this setup, and in actuality, the 22 long rifle and the 22 Magnum both use number 12 shot. However, there's more number 12 shot in the 22 Magnum, and it is of higher velocity. So I think that explains the better penetration and what looked like uh, bigger holes that were being struck at a higher velocity, which moved the paper more. So uh, you live and you learn. What we've got here is the 45 Colt, which I did find out actually is a bigger shot, it's a number nine shot. So we're transitioning from number 12 shot to a really big load of number nine shot from the 45 Colt. Now I've found this to be very effective and as a matter of fact, eight to 10 feet is still very effective. So we're really close. Let's see how this goes. For the 45 Colt, we have one third ounce of number nine shot. Uh, so it's a considerably bigger wallop. And what we've got here is pieces of the plastic 
a shot shell cartridge are kind of spread around. A bit of the plastic shot shell cartridge, probably at this close distance with some shot still in it maybe. But these are obviously bigger holes. Everything had no trouble penetrating this through and through, including the back of the target. I can speak from personal experience. This is very effective load. This kills field rats out here, you know, the odd dangerous snake that you come onto around the house. And things like that, basically any small varmint like that. So now we know. Well, now we've run through all three of these. Keep in mind that these shot cartridges from CCI are also available in 38 Special, in 44 Special, in 9mm, and actually in 45 ACP. Would I recommend these for self-defense? No. But if you've got chores around the farm, if you've got uh, rats in your garage, you know, that kind of a thing, that's what these are for. And so if you really are dealing with larger critters like rats, at least the 22 Magnum, and then when you move up to 38 Special, uh, 44 Special, 45 Colt, you actually have something that's very effective.